A local nonprofit is helping to give some of our neighbors living with disabilities an unforgettable adventure. And News 4 Tucson's Connor McGill went to Sabino Canyon, where the group is turning challenge into hope. Reaching new heights while exploring the great outdoors. Loop 5 Adventures Tucson proving that with the help of others, you can embark on any journey. It's a sunny morning at Sabino Canyon. Today, Brandon Kenya and Sam Durkop are getting ready to take on a hiking experience like none other. Once the hiker is seated, this will fold out. This is all made possible with the help of Luke's Five Adventures Tucson. Its mission, hiking with those who can't hike themselves. Janet Howe is the director of the local Tucson group. We go on the paths where able-bodied people can hike and where wheelchairs cannot access. It may seem like a daunting task, but with what organizers call a rosy, a chair cycle using the concept of an old-fashioned mountain rescue apparatus and a handful of volunteers, the impossible is made possible. I never even knew this was a possibility. I didn't know that these hiking chairs were out there and there was actually an organization that did that. So when I learned about that, it just blew me away. It's both a challenging and rewarding experience. Today marks the group's 79th hike. Many volunteers continuing to come back to help again and again. I think I'm on my 25th hike, so. Um. And, uh, ooh, I think I'm on my, I've been 15 or 20. To be able to take somebody on the trails that we take for granted, because we hike all the time, mm -hmm. is really cool. With every hike, memories that will last a lifetime. The waterfall was amazing, the plants blooming, the flowers, all of it. It's hard to take in all at once, but it was an amazing experience. Hell says opening the door for others has been one of the most rewarding moments in her life. Such a blessing to be able to get people out into nature. Tucson's so beautiful and they don't get to see it, and to experience it. So to be able to make that happen just makes us so happy. The group hopes to reach 100 hikes by the end of 2024. Connor McGill, News for Tucson.